Hello, I'm John Furrier with SiliconANGLE News and host of theCUBE and welcome to our news update for MWC in Barcelona, the premier event for cloud and te the telecommunication industry. News today, VMware in the news has lots of announcements where it's expanding its line of products for communication service providers with open RAN portfolio. VMware has unveiled service management and orchestration framework for simplifying and automating radio access networks and their applications. RANs have traditionally been proprietary because of their need for low latency and speed and the O-RAN Alliance is championing an open standard that would expand the number of players in the RAN ecosystem. According to Sanjay Upai, Senior Vice President and General Manager of the Service Provider and Edge Business Unit at VMware, VMware is at the forefront of getting deployed in telcos both in the RAN as well as the core and VMware hopes they can extend their leadership from the enterprise data center and SD-WAN and be the de facto standard in the RAN. VMware is also announcing a technical preview that will allow communication service providers to run disaggregated and virtualized RAN functions directly on bare metal servers using VMware Tanzu. Project Y is the initiative aimed at telecom providers that need flexibility in how they deploy edge devices. The VMware Telco cloud platform is also being improved to deliver carrier grade intelligent networking and lateral security features such as distributed firewall and intrusion detection and prevention. Along with support for energy efficient use cases for 4G and 5G core load balancing. For enterprise customers, VMware is delivering new and enhanced remote worker device connectivity and intelligent wireless capabilities to its SD-WAN and secure access service edge or SASE products. It's also expanding its collaboration with Intel aimed at delivering new edge applications based on 5G connectivity that will support SD-WAN use cases involving mobile and internet of things devices. Again, VMware expanding their portfolio in the news. Again, VMware is not stopping. Of course, the Cube's all the coverage of VMware Explorer will be coming up this year in 2023. Don't miss that. But at MWC, Dave Vellante and Lisa Martin, the entire Cube team are there for four days of live coverage. Of course, all the news and reporting is on siliconangle.com. For all the action, go there. And of course, thecube.net is where the broadcast is in Barcelona. This is the Cube News. Thanks for watching. <laughs>